23rd, 2018 edition of Ferry County View. Superior Court article by Brenda Starkey. Republic, a man and woman pleaded guilty in a plea agreement Monday morning in Ferry County Superior Court cases, which had been scheduled to go to trial this week. Dwayne L. Simpson, 71, Republic pleaded guilty to indecent liberties with a victim who was physically helpless. His plea was an Alfred plea, in which he does not admit guilt, but admits there may have been enough evidence presented at trial for a jury to find him guilty. The standard range for the charge is 15 to 20 months in prison and 36 months community custody. Joanna R. Jewell, 53, Republic pleaded guilty to fourth degree assault with sexual motivation in an Alfred plea. The charge carries a maximum sentence of 364 days in jail and or a $5,000 fine. The two cases which had been joined for trial were set for a jury trial this week and each defendant was charged with first degree kidnapping and first degree rape. The case stems from an incident in June 2017 where Simpson and Jewell were accused of taking a Republic woman home for a sexual interlude. Sentencing for both individuals is set for June 18th. Three individuals pleaded not guilty to charges. Daniel W. Ammerman, 39, Colville, pleaded not guilty to second degree assault with a deadly weapon, domestic violence, first degree unlawful possession of a firearm, felony harassment, fourth degree assault, domestic violence, third degree malicious mischief, and five counts of reckless endangerment, domestic violence. The charges stem from a May 14th incident when Ammerman, a convicted felon, allegedly assaulted his girlfriend and shot at her minivan as she and her children attempted to flee. Ammerman's bail was set at $100,000. A July 5th trial was set in the case. Jason Lee Strandberg Biggs, 33, Curlew, pleaded not guilty to possession of a controlled substance, heroin, conspiracy to manufacture dimethyltryptamine, and use of drug paraphernalia. A July 5th trial was set in the case. Matthew P. J. Sutton, 23, Kettle Falls, pleaded not guilty on Monday, May 14th, to residential burglary and third degree theft. The charges stem from a March burglary where Sutton allegedly took money from an elderly woman's purse while she slept in her home in Barstow. Sutton's bail was set at $5,000 and a July 5th trial was set in the case.